Let us welcome ourselves to the deciduous forest that explodes with life. Discontinuous mountains of the Eastern Ghats are stretched over area of miles. It harbors perennial streams that flows rhythmically with the breathtaking landscapes singing to the rhythms. The spreaded meadows are a common picture skew here. Rich in the spectacular wildlife, it is home to many elusive species of flora and fauna. It harbors a rich biodiversity. Not only the wildlife but also it fosters a diversified human culture and customs. The beauty of nature if slightly unraveled can astonish you in Koraput, a district of Orissa and an integral part of the Eastern Ghats. Among all incredible mountains lies the highest peak of Orissa, Deomali, approximately 1672 meters from the sea level. A new group of explorers ventured to unravel the beauty of Deomali. We bring to you the adventures of Deomali and its sensational beauty. During monsoon, a cover of lichen is seen over the rocks. It is quite different than deep jungle. It says a different story as the altitude rises and vegetation density is low, yet life here thrives under the rocks. As the top is flat surface, reptiles, arcanids, aves and arthropods lurk out to add the beauty of the place. The alluring mountains, streams, and waterfalls attract different scientists, wildlife photographers to live their dream. On a beautiful sunny day, one can view the huge winged creatures at their best. Nature here exists at its very pristine form, giving likely freedom of survival to each. Unlike Deomari, Kupteshwar tells a very different story. It is world famous pilgrim dedicated to Lord Shiva. A pilgrim site situated about 55 km away Jaipur in Koraput. Inside the large caves stands large stalactite. Flanked by the Kulav river and surrounded by a dense sal forest, the shrine is called Gupteshwar. Monsoon and summer shows different colors of this place. During monsoon, the area is densely covered with vegetation and overflowing streams. It gives shelter to different species. 
as we ventured out, we majorly encountered damselflies, frogs, toads, birds, and mollusks. As the drop of the rains give life to the lichens on the surface of rock, this baby snail paves its way forward. while the spiny or weaver spider becomes busy in weaving its web. Many reptiles, calots and water birds congregate to prey upon. Not only this, sometimes the stealthy mugger is seen in the river bed of Sirbeda. The tall and stout sal forest stand to provide a platform for birds to reside on. Home to different terrestrial birds and mammals, it is a land of beauty and spectacular contrast. The religious belief it holds helps the human and the nature to survive in harmony, giving opportunity to different explorers. The big caves are home to different species of bats surviving in the dark of the caves and night becomes more active than day. As life goes and grows here, though being a world of tranquil beauty and serenity, sometimes brutal struggles show their glances. As days pass by and civilization started, there has been endless threats to the nature raising their heads. The major threat being human activities, habitat loss, deforestation, unawareness among people, increasing wildlife trade, boosting population, ultimately resulting in the climate change. Mining, forest clearance and overgrazing are a major concern for the depletion of natural resources. Though Koraput faces major challenges, yet there are sites unexplored, treasures hidden in this area in the form of biodiversity and tribal culture.
The need of the hour is to undo the surprises of mother nature, know the significance and work for their conservation. Because if we start now, we can make up for the past losses. These forests are ultimate need, so it needs a conservation. As Mr. M. S. Swaminathan said, I quote, If conservation of natural resources goes wrong, nothing else will go right. I unquote.